Okay, let's try number two now. Miss Blessing, which problem is he supposed to do? Number two. Number two. Okay. So he moved on to number three, and this time he got it right on his own. Oh, great job. He can. He, has he done number two? He hasn't. Yeah, yeah. He finished number two. I'll send you a picture. Oh, great. Great. Okay. Okay, so Srika, do number four then. You did it right, so you can do it now. Can you send the pictures on the group? Oh, to the group? Okay, I'll send it. Hello. Yes, I can hear you. Can you check number two? If it's right, tell me if I miss anything. And I will do number three. Okay. You didn't do anything to this. What happened to this guy here? What do you do with this guy here? Hmm. Uh, Ali, okay. you know, when you see something like this, you know, there's like an invisible one here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Don't forget that. Okay. Okay. Let me start yeah. to do it again. Okay. Yeah. Do it again.
Besende. Okay. When you have a negative two, all right, yes. you have a negative two, and this is a one. A negative two, negative one. What should it give you? Negative one. Negative three. Negative three. Are you with me? Mm -hmm. Okay. So that should give you a negative three. Then this five should still be five. You can't add this two because they are different. Their variables are different. So they can't be they can't be joined together. So uh, your final answer will be this. 5x square y minus 3xy. Okay. Do you see that? Yes, I repeat minus in the 5, that's why. Yeah. So try number 3. Okay. Try number 3. Miss Blessing? Yes. So one thing I'm noticing uh, when he's practicing these problems, if, if there's a problem that says simplify something, like, you know, how right now they are simplifying, yeah. three good things that he needs to get a numeric answer, okay? Oh. So, and, uh, and what he does is another thing, he drops uh drops things like on problem number five okay if i am not next to him he has dropped y he has dropped the z or the z he has dropped all of them and they've got the answer three x minus two. Oh wow, wow mm -hmm. yeah, that's what he drops them why can how can you drop a problem yeah. you cannot change in yeah. algebra yeah. you can never change yeah. what yeah. they have in yeah. the expression yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. let's do it again i'm cool you are you're definitely very cool but you know what try the problem start from i say them okay write your problem and do it again okay You, you're also making that mistake too early okay uh, which mm -hmm. you can't 
you you can't you can't have a final answer in this case as this mm -hmm. are you with me okay okay this p this is p square q mm -hmm. all right this is p q they are not these two are not the same with this are you uh, with me you have grouped them here they are different okay mm -hmm. this is p squared q p squared q they are the same that's why you brought them together p q p q they are the same the variables are the same that's why you brought them together okay when you find the answer for this which you got as six you added the four and two six p q uh, p square q then mm -hmm. this negative yeah. six p q what is what is negative six p q negative eight p q what what's the answer negative 14. good negative 14 p q all right you still gonna drop this guy here this six p q all right so you're gonna have six p square q so this will be your final answer. You can't combine these two. Okay. Do you get that? You can't combine these two because they have different what? They are different terms, different variables. This one has the power of two. This one doesn't have the power of two. It has the power oh. of one. So they are yeah. different. That means if they have different uh, exponents, they different. Yes. Okay. They are different terms. You can't bring them together. They are not. They are not related. Are you with me? Try. Try number. Uh, try number number
I see it, Ali. Good job. Good job, Ali. Yes, yes, continue on number five. Good job. Miss Blessing? Yes. I sent you a picture for number five that he did on his own. Okay. Okay, no problem. Let's uh, just hold on a bit. Let uh, Ali do number five. Too. Yeah, because I think you. I want you to help him with the problem he. I see here that he's having. All right, just one minute. Let Ali also try number five. Okay. Sweeko. Yeah. Half way correct. Okay, yeah. and half way wrong. Yeah. So Miss Blessing is going to tell you where exactly you did wrong. Yeah, I'm good. Anyone, of course. Anyone who does algebra is very cool. Um, Miss Blessing. Yes. Okay. Now number five. Uh, it looks like multiplication. With with what I supposed to multiply with a two? Why do you use a two? This is two x plus three y minus four z. Why I supposed to do this one? Confuse me. I did the same thing. I regroup the like term or something different. If you watch the video for a day, I think this is day 11. Have you watched the videos on this? Watch uh, two weeks ago when you sent it or three weeks ago. I didn't watch it again. Okay. All right. So this is a positive sign in between the parentheses. So the parentheses, they are not multiplying each other. For this first parenthesis, you ask, is there anything in front of it? There's mm -hmm. nothing in front of it. So you can just knock, knock it out. You can just, like, there's an invisible one outside here multiplying everything, and which will still be the same thing. Are you with me? Yeah, but for I, here I, now, mm -hmm. for here now, there's a positive sign. So this sign would affect everything here. Okay? so. You do a positive times x, it gives you a positive x. You do a positive times negative 2, it, still, it gives you a negative 2y. You do a positive times positive 4, it's a positive 4, 7. Positive yeah. times negative 3 is a negative 3. Yeah. Do you see that? Yeah, uh, that means the first one is 1. Here? Yeah. yeah. No, 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 no. 1 times 2x is 2x, 1 times 3x is plus 3y, mm -hmm. 1 times negative this is negative 4z, 1 times 5 is positive 5. You know, 1 times anything will give you that same thing. Are you with me? Is everyone with me? Let's, let's, let's do the first one together, then you do this one. All right? So we have 2 x plus 3y minus 4z plus 5 in parentheses plus in close parentheses x minus 2y plus 4z minus 3 okay yeah there's nothing in front of this parentheses so i can just kick it down this of me confusing you with that one just remove the parentheses since there's nothing here so you are left with what 2x plus 3y minus 4z plus 5. Here, there's a positive sign here. All right. You can see here in this question we have a negative. So you use that sign, okay, to multiply everything here. And you know when you have a positive here, you have like an invisible one here, just for you to help you, okay, to help you, you know, bring everything together. So you have positive 1 times x, it gives you a positive 1x. Positive 1 times negative 2, it gives you a negative 2y. Positive 1, remember, you're using the sign to multiply the signs to, of the terms here. 
positive one times positive this is a positive four z and positive one times negative three is a negative three do you see that okay once there's a sign an operational sign in between two brackets this bracket cannot affect this parenthesis just like let me quickly take you to this this uh, slide here when we are doing the foil method that will be the next thing when you have two parentheses back to back okay when it is back to back without any sign here okay it means now that this parenthesis we affect this we affect this other parenthesis don't worry we're going to learn when we come here we'll learn for it all right is everyone following me yeah okay so from here now we now start grouping Sikra, do you see that you don't drop you don't drop any you don't drop this is simplification it is not evaluating if it was evaluating they would have put in the value of the question will say where x is equal to maybe one and where stop that bit, and where z is equal to maybe two and where y is equal to maybe four yeah. but it's not evaluating it is simplifying we are simplifying all right so we are still going to have our variables our letters so simplifying means bring all terms that are the same combine them that's what simplifying means so all terms are the same we have two x here we have positive one x here let's bring it together so two x plus one x we have positive three y here we have negative two y here bring it together positive three y negative two y we have negative z here positive z here bring them together because they are the same variable so they are the same term they are brothers and sisters so we have negative four z positive four z now we have positive five and negative three so positive five negative three. so from here we combine because they are the same they can become one so 2x plus 1x will give us 3x. Yeah. It's not x squared. Yeah. Yeah. It's x squared. Yeah. Don't even positive, positive 3y minus 2y. That's, we are going to subtract. So we are going to have a positive 1y. This is negative 4 positive 4. It's like negative 4 positive 4, which will be 0. So this will cross out as 0. Here we now have positive 5, negative 3. What is positive 5, negative 3? We subtract. When we subtract, we get a 2. And what would the sign of 2 take? It will take the sign of the bigger number, which is positive. So finally, here we have our answer as well, 3x plus y. Remember in maths, you won't, in your answer, you won't see this one. It will be just y plus 2. So this would be our answer. Do we see that now? Okay. So, Sikra, can you try number six? Ali, try number six. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> I 
hours. Oh, warm me up, warm me up, warm me up. Mom, you are. Mom is busy. Mom is Hello. Um, Slesson, I get negative. Yeah. Let me see. Send a picture. Okay. Okay, let's send a picture. Send a picture. On the okay, picture. okay. Yeah, Srika, can you be helping me? He's really struggling a bit here. Let him send what he has done. Yeah, I've sent it. Okay. Okay. Let, uh, all right. Let me, let me, I'll check everyone's work now. Um, it's not yet ready. I'm working hard. That's good. I will see that it is not ready. Hmm? Okay. Okay, Ali, have you sent yours? Yes, because I don't have space, I'm copying now, but this is the answer, the final answer I get. 
negative 2ab minus c plus 9. All right. All right, let's let's look at it together, okay? All right. So here. So here, since there's nothing in front of here, we just cancel out the parentheses. So we are left with 3ab plus 2c minus d minus 7. All right. Now, a trick is when a positive multiplies everything here, it's still the same. So you don't need to start saying positive times is positive times. It will still be the same. Positive times negative would still would be negative. Are you with me? So it will still be the same. All right. So you don't start, um, you know, stressing yourself out because positive times is a positive 2AB. Positive times negative C is still a negative C. Positive times positive D is still a positive D. And positive times positive 7 is still a positive 7. All right. So you just write positive 2AB minus C plus D plus 7. So let's group. This is a common term with this. So we do 3AB plus 2 a b 2c is a common term with with negative c so we group them together so we have positive 2c negative c negative d and we have a positive d remember when you say a single number it's a one in front of it invisible one invisible one so let me put this invisible one okay so we have a negative 1d and positive 1d then finally we have a negative 7 positive 7 so that's a negative 7 positive 7 so let's combine them now this is 3ab plus 2ab it gives you 5ab this is positive 2c negative 1 we are going to subtract so we have a 1 and the 1 will take a positive number so that's a positive 1c here is negative 1d, positive 1d. We're subtracting, so we'll get a zero. So we'll cancel it off because negative 1, positive 1 is zero when we subtract. Here also, we have negative 7, positive 7 is also uh, zero because we subtract. 7 minus 7 is zero. So we cross this. So our final answer we're left with this is plus zero, plus zero which is the same thing as what 5ab plus c. Do you see that, everyone? Uh, Miss Blessing, could you bring up Srika's picture and show him where he's going wrong? OK. But because Ali, do you, do you see that, Ali? Yes, I see that. That means, OK, uh, the same sign cancel each other. I remember right now. Different signs. Same I mean. sign? No, no. no? Different signs, negative and positive, cancel each other. And, and their values have to be the same. This is one and one. Mm -hmm. Okay? It's not about negative and positive canceling each other. No. Mm -hmm. This is negative one, positive one. Remember, when you have a negative and positive number, what do you do? You subtract, right? Yes. yes. So when you do one minus one, it gives you zero. So that's why this cancels off. Then here, you have negative seven positive seven. When you have a negative and positive number, according to the rules, you do what? You subtract. So when you subtract, we do seven minus seven, which you give us zero. So that's why this is all zero. Okay? Okay. I think my problem is when I see uh, the letters, the variable, I forget like each variable was supposed to be one, to replace it for number one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. A lot. Of, a lot of people have that problem too. You're not. You're not the first. Okay. So when you see a letter just standing alone without any number in front of it, there's an invisible one in front of it. Okay. So, Sikra, let's see uh, your work. Let's see what what happened. No. No. Okay. No problem. So let's see what you did. No, sure, you guys. No, you're going swimming. 
cigarette, don't jump step. You're trying to go very uh, forward and uh, two step forward, Sigra. Mm -hmm. Open everything up, arrange everything up before you start grouping them. Yeah. Okay? You see the way I arrange everything, open everything up. Then now start picking them up. That's how you become better. So you have 2C and negative uh, negative uh, C, 1C. Are you with me? When you, don't, when you don't open them up, you get confused. And there's no equal to sign here. This is not an equation. It's an algebraic expression. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. All right. So you have to open them up. Let, let us all try the... Um, I want you to try number seven quickly, everyone. Okay. Try down number seven. Ali, let me let me put back what I did on the screen. Let's see if okay. it's going to come back. Is it going to come back? Uh -huh. Okay. So try number seven. No problem. Uh, excuse me, Miss Blessing. Yes. Uh, yes. Uh, Srika needs to leave. Okay, no problem. Yeah, see? Yeah. So finish your problem. Check the answer, send it. Okay. Miss Blessing, uh, Srika still still doing it. Uh, it looks like, no, no, I didn't finish. I forget negative two, B, negative four. Wait. Just cross check again. Okay. Thank you. 
Nu, nu, ce am dat. Așa. I send it. Okay. Oh, one, one, two. Oh. Okay, Miss Blessing. Yes. Have you sent it? Yeah, he finished. Can you uh, tell him if it is right? One, two, one, two. running late, if you don't mind. One, Oh, which one secret is doing number seven? Yes. Oh, what number are you doing? Seven. That means you have to find answer. Yeah. Is that correct? Sikra is actually correct. Yeah, good. Good job, Sikra. Sikra. So you have to leave now, so say thank you. Sikra. Thank you. Okay, but no I, problem, Sikra. I will stay to listen. So go, go to you. I see you on day. Yeah. I see you on day. I see you on Yes. I see you on Monday. All right, Sikra. All right. I see you on Monday. I see you on Yes. I see you on Monday. I see you on Yes. Go, you need. Go. Uh, you. You, uh, Ali, I think you, 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 you didn't combine the questions well, Ali. You, you made a mistake. I think you, instead of this, this is what you did. Ali, have you seen your mistake? I'm listening to you. You use this and you use this. You're not seeing clearly. Oh. You're, supposed, you're supposed to, this, this is the question. This is number seven. All um, right. Next, the number with the six with seven. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah, quickly look at it again. Miss Blessing, can I ask a question, please? Yes. Uh, so this, these problems, they are on which day? Are they day 10 or day 8? Day 11. Uh, day 11, not practice, right? They're practice for day 11. Oh, understand. Okay, and thank you so much. Uh, no what is the homework that he needs to do? I would send this this on the group now. These four questions. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. So take note of the sign. Let him take note of the sign. Now this is negative, so it's a completely different ball game. All right. Okay. Yeah. Ali, are you trying? Are you trying it again? Yes, I'm doing it right now. All right. Thank <laughs> you. 
Aliazigor. Uh, I will do it and send it to you on WhatsApp. I'm a little busy right now. Oh, and, okay. Yeah, if it's right over. Cool. All right, no problem. All Thank right. You. Okay, take care. And see you next week. Yeah. Okay. Please yeah. do watch the 11 again, okay? I will. All right.